later. I'm calm. <laughs> this is me calm. Theresa. Theresa. Oh, did you feel it? What? Oh. No. Yeah. Of course. <laughs> when Amanda said we're gonna do vegan cheese, I said, why? Hi, I'm Shayla. I'm Amanda. I'm Teresa. Go and on. together we're moms try. Where every week we come together and we try something. Usually alcohol, but you know what? Today we're gonna mix it up. We're gonna try vegan cheese. Mm. Mm. Vegan cheese. So I sounds delicious. I'm very excited about this. They are less excited. So less cheese excited. is literally my favorite food. I could eat a charcuterie board every day. So I'm a little bit scared. Okay. Like vegan cheese, like. So this one is already in a Ziploc bag because that's how it comes. I can't <laughs> stop eating it. Oh my god, really? Yes. So this one is called. It's by the Meadow. Um, <laughs> the Meadow. It's herb and garlic. Oh, because the herbs grow in the meadow, <laughs> and they're vegan. They're not frolicking. The vegan forest is frolicking with the herbs. Why are you <laughs> going to talk to them? Okay, so this is actually from Richmond, BC. Oh, and from the meadow. Like it is so good because Richmond has a lot of meadow. It is so I good. See. Then this much is already gone. I can't wow. stop eating it. I, dill in it though. <gasps> I love like... dill. Dill's my favorite. Okay. That's, why it, that's why it smells like pickles. We just lost the middle cheese. I don't know about this. Oh, it's so good. Oh, we're eating. This it is it is my favorite. Richmond, you did you did us well. It's spreadable. The consistency of it is very nice. Whereas I have had some vegan cheeses that are like rubber. They are okay. not as nice. First off. Um, you guys should probably told me it was not vegan because my mind goes. I'm one of those people that, you know what I mean? Like, I'm like, oh, it kind of tastes like pate. Like, it's kind of weird. It's made from cashews and almonds. Oh, I like it. Yeah, not bad. It's not bad. good, hey? Yeah. The dill's good in it. Mm -hmm. It's not like cheese, though. I, dillerific. But it's like dill tastic. It's spreadable like a cream cheese. Like some people. <laughs> I love this one. Okay. Oh, these that are slices. Really like we're gonna have like these are slices. Okay. So where's our burgers? Okay. So this one's well, called tofu. I'm not reading anything anymore. This one's, I'm not this, stuff. Stuff. this okay. one's called chow. This one is from <laughs> Seattle, <laughs> Washington. Oh, I have to have a whole slice. Can we just no, split can it? Can we split, split it? it? No, I don't want a whole slice. I just chow want, like, down, Chow Town. I want. Oh my God. That's actually not bad. That's actually not bad. Where did you get all of these? It's better than a craft single. Nature's fair. Every single one of them? Every one. Oh. This is actually not bad. It's not bad at all for this a cheese slice. Dude, yeah. this is better than a craft single. Is this you? is actually, I could I could eat this. Like, I, yeah. This is this actually is not bad. a very good cheese. Yeah. I'm impressed. When they <gasps> Jeans! You can buy this for your boy. He is yeah, lactose yeah, yeah. intolerant. That's right. And That's it's right. good. And These are good cheese really good. slices. They're convincingly we'll have to let cheesy. you know. That's very a, good. I can eat that. I, I would eat that. I honestly, I did not. I I'm, am excited I'm impressed. About I'm kind this of impressed. One. Creamy original with chow tofu. Yeah, that one was. Actually I'm actually. Really good. I'm yeah, actually. So Monterey Jack flavor. To be honest, Monterey Jack's one of my favorite cheeses. Mine too. Especially so, with jalapeno. Yes, Monterey Jack. My all-time favorite is jalapeno Monterey Jack. I buy the slices of it. I want my burger. This I... is by. <laughs> <laughs> it fell on the floor. It's gone. This is by Daya. Daya. Yeah, I don't know how to say it. Jeez. It's from Vancouver. Oh, Vancouver. Did you know that? There you go. No, I have Local. no idea. And then so Monterey Jack flavor. Gonna have some more water. My youngest eats Daya cheese like the slices all the time on his sandwiches, oh. and he loves it. He's tried right. a couple it's different. It's a block, though. It's a block. It's not a slice, right? Yeah. It is a block, okay. which is great for making macaroni and cheese. Does it melt? Like, how does it? Yeah. Melt? yeah it how does. well does it melt? Pretty good. Mm. It doesn't taste it's the same as Monterey Jack cheese. It's a little bit different, but it's doable. I don't like. Mm. It. Like, I don't actually mind it. I don't you like don't like it? One. I don't really like this one, but I don't think I like Monterey Jack. I, think that, I actually don't like this one. What I like either. about this more than the first one a little bit is the the the, the 
consistency of the cheese itself. Like I'm really, I'm a texture weirdo. This one's more of like cheese. cheese. Okay, wait, that's what's doable. The... It's doable, like it's not bad. Primary ingredient. This mm. one was cashew, right? The yeah. first one? Almonds and cashew. This one is mm -hmm. coconut oil. This one has coconut oil too. This one has potato starch, potato starch, and then tofu. So tofu is not. So I don't usually meat. like tofu, so I'm shocked at how much I like that. This one is tapioca starch, coconut oil, pea protein. This one is basically pea protein. It, pea? There's a pea protein, like P E A, and yeah. P E A starch. Not like urine. Yeah, like so it's, you it's not free. This one is good for all kids. They can take it to school. Hopefully it's in Love a the name. So it's supposed to be like Brie. It's called Unbreelievable. Yeah. Kudos to those people who named it that. I like I like puns like that. It, the primary ingredient is cashews. Oh, another mm. cashew. So not I'll cash, school. I'll cash you later. <laughs> not school <laughs> friendly. <laughs> Just kidding. I Mom do. Joke. I love Brie. So I'm mm. really hoping this is good. It's unbelievable. You don't? I love brie too. Like, I'll eat I, any okay. cheese. I'm talking, I eat blue cheese like that people don't, like, I eat cheese. Alright, I'll try it. I like cheese. I mean, you have to, you have to try it. Oh, I'm gonna try it. I'll try it. That was chunk. a big chunk. It's very sour. Oh. <laughs> that does not taste like brie. That's probably why it's called unbreelievable because it doesn't taste like brie. No. Mm -mm. If you're a brie lover and trying to be vegan? Don't. Oh, no, no, no. But it's, it is sour. Why is that? It's very sour. That's weird. Okay, so this yeah, one that's is the by worst one. That is the Nuts worst one for so Cheese. Nuts for. Nuts for Cheese, which is from London, Ontario. I mean, it's not terrible, but it is very It's sour. not terrible. I would eat it again and again. It's just got a very strong taste. Great. This is called Miyoko's Creamery um, from California. And it is called Vegan Mott's. Perfect Ooh. for pizza and caprese. I was so, going to say, enjoy caprese? hot or cold. I wonder if it's stretchy. Yes, it is, because matzah is stretchy, and that's what you want for pizzas. You put Have you ever tried it. a stretchy matzah? <laughs> yes. Vegan, vegan cheese? matzah? Not Have you ever had a vegan cheese that was this stretchy? This is not... I don't know. It's... Uh, it smells good. <laughs> it doesn't <laughs> taste like matzah. <laughs> it actually tastes like nothing. The gray cheese tastes like nothing. No, I would say it tastes like matzo a little bit. Your hair looks shiny right now. <laughs> I would say that. <laughs> so shiny. So shiny. It actually isn't terrible. It does uh, taste like matzo, but like a spreadable mushy nuts. <laughs> Natsa. It's a Natsa matzo. It's a Natsa matzo. It's a Natsa matzo for oh, me. Oh, there it I can't even. I don't mind that one. It tastes like nothing to me. I really like it. Yeah. Yeah, you would. I like it better than these two. Mm. Oh yeah. Never this one, one and this one are kind of similar to me. This one's no go. Oh my this god, is this is a chili garlic. Very nice. A chili garlic vegan cheese. Yeah, actually that's pretty good. Hey? I'm impressed. You're that up. You got the scissors. Salt Miyoko's creamery? Do you actually like this? Oh my god. I love it a lot. It doesn't taste like anything to me. This one is Island. from Salt Spring Island, BC. Oh, this one? Hold it on. looks like it's is bad. It, it looks like head I'm cheese. I'm not sure. Like it that. Chunks I don't like that. I don't like head what? cheese. It's um, oh, I've never yeah, had it. it looks like cat food. It could be spreadable, but it's more like you oh, know. Oh, I don't know if I can taste it. It looks like cat food. It little legit looks like cat food. It is really good, oh, is it? <laughs> no. It's not cheese good? No. Mm. no. But it's like a oh. it's like, hey, I just made this dip and then Ugh. made it into nope. a block. Nope, nope, <laughs> nope. I don't love it. Mm. No. I don't hate it. You don't hate it? It's It's got oh, yeah. a little kick to it. <laughs> it does. A little and kick. it's kind of good. I, so, wouldn't, I wouldn't use this for a cheese. I would use it for something else. I'm not sure what. But so do these you, ones are all great cheese substitutes. This one. <laughs> I would not introduce at a party as a cheese. But that doesn't mean it doesn't taste good. Fuck this it. one is from California. So it tried to and it is called Miyoko's. Also, Same the brand. mozzarella. Sharp farmhouse style. Mm. Demi fan. Huh? Cashews fermented with live cultures. It's not bad. So it's a it's a cashew mm. base, not mm. safe for schools. Um, it, if you like a sharp cheddar. It is. Ooh. It is. <laughs> I just spilled the water. And we're back. 
Okay. With Pulse Kitchen Sharp Cashew Cheddar. Oh, oh. trying to weasel my Made lady. with local gluten free beer for oh. extra sharpness. I this one that. contains cashews, so also not okay for school. Ooh. This <laughs> one is from Penticton, and it is very bright orange. Mm. Almost fake orange, if you will. I, no, no, maybe oh, I saw that. It looks like baby may, food. Orange. Maybe it's from turmeric. It looks like. You don't know. This might don't egg. take too much. <laughs> <laughs> it doesn't smell good. It doesn't matter. Oh, it smells weird. Like mustard. No, like chemicals. Okay. Well, what, what is the ingredients? Where's the English? Oh my god. Apple oh, cider vinegar. Okay. It's all ingredients. Apple cider vinegar. That makes sense now. It's all ingredients we can read. So that's good. If you spread it thin, it's not it's terrible. It's not terrible. That's what she said. Um, if you spread it thinly, it's not that bad. It's from Penticton. Again. Just gonna... Yeah, um, it's not terrible. I mean, I'm not, the crackers really good. I like these crackers. I'm not well. mad at this one. I'm not, it's not too bad, actually. Uh, let me try more because I, I'm confused now. Definitely number one is chow. Chow, chow. Okay, so your favorite is yeah, chow. Chow. It's, it what's, your, chow. what's your second favorite? I think it might be this one. Like legit. Oh, okay. Too legit to quit, yo. Okay, so Shayla's top two are well, yeah, I'm, try I'm trying another okay. spread. Don't. Which is actually by Field Roast Company. I'm gonna I'm gonna try this thing. I really like this one. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna go I am very happy with this one. Me this too. One. Like I would actually buy that. My top three mm -hmm. are I have to like this one. My top three, I gotta say, are this one, vegan cheese by the meadow. <laughs> the Chow. Meadow. And Miyoko's mozzarella. I, These are my top. This three. is number one for me, number two, and this is actually number three. I don't yeah. mind this one. It's not terrible. Mm -hmm. That comes mm -hmm. in a fourth for sure. Yeah, those are. I actually don't mind this one. I like these three and this number four. It's Holy not, shit, we agree on that. something. What? We agree on vegan, vegan cheese. cheese out of anything. That's weird. Have you ever had vegan cheese? No, this is my first time. Ever. I'm a vegan virgin. And I know you've had vegan cheese. I have, before. but not good ones. Why did we choose to try vegan cheese? Because Amanda was looking for a tasty vegan cheese. Mm -hmm. So right. I really wanted to find a good vegan cheese. And I, I have think found you have. Some. Like, there's a couple I good options here. I found three, four, five. I'm not mad at any of them. Thanks right, for well, joining us for Mom's <laughs> Try Vegan Cheese. Yeah, and then you guys... You can either take our I'm opinion really and happy our suggestions. That none of them were terrible. I'm gonna eat lie because I've had terrible vegan cheese before. The chili one. I'm impressed. And this is a different um, route for us, so we hope you guys enjoyed it just as much as the other ones. And if not, let us know. So make sure you like this video and then subscribe and then let us know in the comments below what you'd like us to try next. Whether it's alcohol, whether it's food. Whether it's weird sauces, makeup, it doesn't no, matter. Makeup, yeah, makeup. It doesn't matter. We'll try it. We'll Just try anything. Give us your suggestions. We'll it better be good. Bye. Teresa's hard to please, but thanks for joining us for another Mom's Try video. Bye. <laughs> She's got the cheese. Like, cheers.